did that to my daughter and that she's just walking around like nothing happened. A mother upset over the handling of a child abuse case involving a teacher at a Henderson daycare. 8 News Now reporter Joshua Piguero was in court this morning for that hearing. Where the former teacher and victim's parents saw each other for the first time since the incident. The arrest warrant for the former preschool teacher was filed on July 2nd. Three weeks later, she finally appeared in court and heard from the victim's mother. I would really like it that she was incarcerated due to the, her actions and that she receives a full bail amount. But that's not what the judge gave Heather Hefner on Wednesday. She allowed the 24-year-old to avoid jail. Hefner was processed to take this mugshot. The ruling upset Kayla Zomerdyke. It's unbelievable. Henderson police say this is Hefner in a video that went viral, violently grabbing three-year-old Lily Royal. It happened on April 19th inside DJ's Christian daycare. In the short clip we obtained, you can't see what court documents say were at least three incidents in a span of two minutes that captured Hefner allegedly abusing Royal. It's been over three months. I haven't had one apology from her. I haven't had an apology from DJ's Christian Center. I've had no one reach out to me. Days after the incidents, state investigators with child care licensing stopped by DJ's Christian daycare. Their report determined that Hefner failed to implement positive discipline and mishandled the child. Hefner no longer works there. That teacher will appear in court again on October 2nd. The victim's parents tell me they plan to be in court for her hearing. Reporting at Henderson Justice Court, Joshua Pagero, 8 News Now. DJ's Christian Daycare and Heather Hefner declined to comment for this story. Henderson police say Hefner had worked at the school for four years and had no prior complaints.